In the last three years, I've had about one tooth break in about every three to six months. It started off with a, a opiate addiction to pills and it just gradually progressed. I ended up being a heroin addict. When was the last time you had heroin? 18 months ago. They hadn't counted. They ain't counting, that's right. You might have trouble finding a vein. There's a lot of scar tissue in there, so. I see that. When I first got clean, I was like, you know, that's one of the things that I want to be able to do is have a good smile again, because I'm scared to smile nowadays, you know? I have some inner self-esteem now. I feel like I need some outer self-esteem. Dr. Kirkpatrick, he was very informative. The other places I went, they were trying to push me through the door and in and out kind of thing. He did sit down with us, took the time and talked to us. I walked out of this place saying, wow, this is where I'm gonna get it done at. There's no doubt about it, you know. Oh, wow. Oh my God. It's been three months since my procedure here at No Teeth Now. Even in a short period of time, I've gotten a job, I've been promoted, and I'm not scared to smile, I'm not scared to talk to anybody. And regardless of what people say, it does matter how you look. First impressions are, are, are lasting impressions, especially if you meet somebody one time. Gratitude is, is an amazing thing, really. Just being grateful for what you have and grateful to be in this world, you know. I can't think New Teeth now enough, the future, is limitless now, I feel. It really is a life-changing event for me. If you would like to view more informational videos on New Teeth Now, please click the subscribe button here. Thanks for watching.